Hello, everybody. Welcome back to uh, the unnamed podcast where the points don't matter. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> Good '90s reference. <laughs> I am a uh, panda here. I with uh, with Lucci and Link. How you doing, boys? It's a cold night. I don't do boys. You don't do boys. You're doing them today. Congratulations. I am disappointed that you did not want to play Baldur's Gate. Uh, there's nothing wrong with playing Baldur's Gate. I don't. I listen. Listen. Marshall doesn't have the the attention span to to deal with the cutscene parts. Wait, and, and that's the fun part. What? Like, like, Bitch. like we we were all wanting to play it the other day, and you were like, "No!" Like the emperor, like I was, no. I was cleaning. No. Yeah, I was about to say he had to clean his basement. No. Man. Otherwise, I wouldn't be able to fit on my cooler. Yeah. Actually, you wouldn't. It was full. Oh my. Yeah, no, it got full the last two times I was here, man. Oh, <laughs> just shat in it. Just that in my cooler? Yeah. <laughs> Let's go. Stinky cooler. Uh, how you boys been doing? It's uh getting close to the end of the year. Um, I I'm I'm doing good, man. How was your holidays? The holiday was pretty good. Yeah. How it, was your holiday? Was oh, my my. <laughs> Yowch. I'm stuck in. So... Oh. I was talking to my, Mars, dude. I was talking to Mars. My in-laws were nice. I mean, they they bought me uh, new shoes. Uh-huh. And, uh... Take that all you without shoes. What the... What? That, why? That's so rude. So rude. Just gotta got a pair of shoes for Christmas. Um... <laughs> when my in-laws basically bought me a pair of shoes, I mean, I, uh... A new mug from my brother in law. I got I got some new Warhammer figs. Oh. Yeah. I like figs. Yeah. I and got twigs. the uh what the fu one's a fruit, the other one's can't. It is what it is. <laughs> you guys are left twigs or right twigs? Sorry, oh. figurines. Figurines. No, listen. Left twigs or right twigs? Both. It's always left. I think we cut them in They're half. They're all left Twix. I was going to say, if we cut them... It's always left Twix. If we cut them... No, because there's literally a package that says... Yeah. Even if it is the right Twix, it's the left Twix. Mm-hmm. Two different factories. Seen the commercials. You can't fool me. <laughs> Seen the commercials. <laughs> two, di- <laughs> two different Twix factory commercials. Change my mind. Fine, fine. It's all right Twix. It's all right Twix. It's always left, baby. <laughs> I mean, Twix, I... I I wouldn't. If somebody gave me a Twix, I'm like, oh, well, thank you, dude. I won't buy a Twix. Yeah, I don't. I don't ever stop by in the gas station and think, hey, I'm gonna get a Twix. I'm yeah, about to never. Get a lawsuit now because we said it so many times. Twix, Twix, Twix. Twix, Twix. Yeah. Free <laughs> advertisement, man. Listen, bad publicity or all publicity is good publicity. Listen, if Twix sends us a big old box of Twixes, I'm not gonna complain. Yeah, oh. right, Twi- Yes, yes. Uh, Twix. Make sure you send us a box of Twix. Is there a dark chocolate Twix? Can yes, we get, can we get a uh, can we really? get a Twix yeah. counter? <laughs> oh I'm just gonna I'm just gonna put like a random number up there. <laughs> <laughs> just get a Twix counter. Just like how many times can we say Twix? Twix. Uh, it's too predictable if you say it right now. Oh, what is really, the you Twix really Twix? thought I was gonna do it right then too? No. What a twit. Yeah. No, 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 no. I know, I know what I said. <laughs> I tried. Well, anyway, um, Twix are for kids. Huh? What? Hey. That's tricks. No, that's oh, that's a street thing. The tricks are for kids. Tricks are for hoes. Yeah. Uh. Anyway, that's a little bite. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, did it pick it up? Please say yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Um, so as a new year comes comes around, uh, we are in a we're gonna be in a new area of like, fuck my words. Uh, yeah, we got pushed out with your chest, dude. Like that's some weak ass burps. Come on, give me one. Uh, that, was, that was a bit better. That was a bit better. I tasted my coffee. That had the taste. Nice. Better. No, it was pretty good. Uh, Coffee twice is never good. Baka. 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 
Coffee pee. Coffee pee. We're past that. We're way past that. <laughs> Jesus Christ, this is already off the rails. We're already six minutes in. Oh, don't worry. I won't use all of that. I'll just use some of it in, as like a bloopers thing for shorts or something. That's fine. Yeah. <laughs> Us being retarded. If you actually pay attention, I think in the last pod video that I edited, at the very end of the video is the part where I put where you hate deaf people. Yeah. <laughs> I so, so uh, I was going to use that as a short that I was like. <laughs> See, if I was in charge of the account, I would have uploaded it. It, it, was, it, was, it was actually uploaded and scheduled. Oh, no. And then I went back to it. I was like, can I really put this up here? I almost did it. There's still a possibility I might do it. Man, there's some parts where I'm just sitting there, like like the fucking T. I mean, because I mean that was the same one as the T Rex, uh, in the Gestapo outfit. Now we were already pushing limits with that, but you know, <clears throat> art is about pushing the limits, man. Is it? It is really. Yeah. Oh, God. Yeah. Well, comedy is dead, so. No, 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 no. Comedy is not dead. Comedy has gone underground. That's what comedy is now. That's a mold. Sure. And so sure, comedies but... are mold molds now. No. no. I, d- I don't. Are you that a mole? A, no, that is irrelevant. You've been snitching, dude? No, no, no. no. You good? <laughs> Put that baseball bat down, Jesus. <laughs> they called me the Jew Bear. <laughs> <laughs> I beg your pardon? <laughs> no, you don't have to beg. I'll give it to you. Yeah? I'll give it to you anyway. Oh, my. Pancakes, waffles. I like breakfast. French Can I get a smoke and no. a pancake? So, um, we're heading into next year. Um, obviously, it'll be 2024 being uh, a lot of... Can you look at me with, yeah, with some brain cells? Thank you. Oh, <laughs> less brain cells. <laughs> Hold on, how about... You just look like you're constipated. Why are you, why are you so upset about Could being constipated? <laughs> um, we're going to have a new, uh, new year of gaming. Anything in particular that stands out to you that you're looking forward to? Um games oh pal world pal world dude i've been looking at that for like two years now since i've seen that they were working on that i know nothing about pal world um, it's like if you took minecraft pokemon and gave them guns oh so did, did that you look i heard about that no no not missiles guns oh, okay yeah like i've seen what looked like some fucking fat looking friendly pokemon thing with a fucking ak-47 or some shit <laughs> bring that up on screen pull up the video <laughs> We don't have that <laughs> but a cut with Joe Rogan over that. That's the second time since we started potting that you made that joke. Pull up the video. I'm gonna put a flashback. <laughs> <laughs> Every time we make the pull up the video joke, you're just gonna bring up Joe Rogan. Joe Rogan. <laughs> Joe Rogan. Joe Rogan. Send Ro- us a- Rogan. <laughs> and Joe Rogan. Send us a box of Twix. <laughs> <laughs> that's a short right there. Oh, that's going. That's going in the. Oh uh, yeah. It's going in shorts. <laughs> Wow, Dude, this I'm, looks. That is that's kind of sus. Dude, though, look, it's guy. a monkey with like an AK forty seven, that bro. That's the only thing I need. Sold day one automatically. <laughs> I don't know, my guy. That I mean, the art's cool, but it looks like it was drawn by a furry. You know, as long as you ain't clapping cheeks, bro, I'm okay with it. Listen, I it also looks like they stole off, some real off, cooking I, I have seen worse from you, my good sir. I dare not take any judgment from you and the things you say. That record is sealed, sir. Down bad. <laughs> <laughs> we'll let the, we'll let the trailer play with no audio because we uh I didn't set up the audios for no echo. Oh so. well, I'll just fucking rip the video and then put it in editing. Oh well, there yeah, we so go. Look, that thing had a fucking mini gun. That bro. looked like it was so. This is my neighbor Totoro with a mini gun, and that looks like an Eevee that's blue. This is uh either gonna be a really great game. Or a really shit game. There is no in between with yeah, this. Yeah, I agree. I agree. That's why I'm day wanting that shit, bro. Look at that. Look at that. Why are Why are you running around shooting these things? I don't care, but I'm in for it. Then you're also giving them guns too. That's amazing. If you gave Curious George a fucking gun and took him into the jungle with you and told him, "Let's go merge some shit," wouldn't you? Be... <laughs> I guess. Do you be? <laughs> I suppose that'd be interesting. Oh my god. <laughs> my brain, man. I mean, I'm looking yeah, for Space get, we, Marine too. We need to get that. I want to. I want to get that photoshopped. <laughs> my brain. Don't create a mini gun. 
<laughs> that's that's the that's the thumbnail. <laughs> it's just kidding. It's just going to curious storage with a fucking AK forty seven. Please, <laughs> Luna. <laughs> Oh yeah. yeah, every time we got up, uh, so our, our thumbnail editor is also our uh, friend's girlfriend, fiance, wife thing, I don't know, um, <laughs> Pop-Tart. <laughs> anyway, Luna, the person who does our thumbnails, likes to Photoshop fun ideas. I have given her a couple random ones, like NyQuil gummy, fentanyl for breeze, uh, Marshall's <laughs> given her Clorox cigarettes. <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> Battle Crab, riding into war on Clorox a dolphin. Clorox cigarettes was a masterpiece, um, by the way. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm proud of Nyquil gummies. Just put all this. Just put all the pictures on the screen. Just yeah. all of them. Uh, but yeah. Um, whenever I want her to do a photo or an idea that I come up with, which is usually impulsive and also very whimsical, oh. I, I'll just go in, into the Discord and I'll be like, "Okay, really the nothing? sheep with the machine guns is funny." <laughs> no, the <laughs> that's, best. That's great. One of the best ones that I saw. You can enforce them as slaves. Look at that. <laughs> You can make adorable bunnies work in That there. is so depressing. One of the best uh, pictures Nobody's I saw. about Santa Claus and his elves. Okay. <laughs> but so... it's a problem when I put bunnies on a but manufacturing But they're happy one. elves. Nestle can do it, then I can too. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Please don't sue us. <laughs> Send me a jar of chocolate powder for my milk. <laughs> no, he just wants the Twix. That's all we want is more Twix. Nestle, send me a box of Twix. <laughs> <laughs> oh, um, George should have more Twix in one of his hands. <laughs> and AK in the <laughs> other. I'm going to the gas station and buying a Twix. The picture on the screen. <laughs> I'm fucking crying. <laughs> <laughs> got you, oh, I, all right <laughs> don't, don't where we started and where we ended another like i said another game i'm looking forward to is uh space marine 2 okay and the continuation of the story of captain titus okay i'm just trying to get us on track. does he have twix i don't know if he's got twix or not I think the, the space greens. I don't know if they eat Twix. Why are we go? I know they. Twix I know they eat corpse. Uh, you know, they, what do they call they that eat... corpse starch. Yeah, it's basically just dead people. Yeah. Why don't? Why are we going after Twix? We can go after Mars and get Reese's. Boy, <laughs> Reese's are just shit. This is now a podcast where we talk about candy. <laughs> <laughs> I like um, sour candy. I like gummy candy. Oh. They cheap as shit, but I'd be down on some dum-dum sticks. Um, don't, uh, don't get me started. Pops are crunchy as fuck. I like warheads. What's your favorite candy? Reese's. <laughs> Reese's? Yeah. 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 <laughs> That's what I thought. Your mom probably thinks I'm on cocaine. <laughs> <laughs> Give her a Reese's. She she'll probably forget. does. <laughs> She's just hearing us yell about Twix and Reese's in the basement. Twix, some of the and Reese's. <laughs> She's in, we're making the next Fire album of the year, bro. It's going to out in New Year. Jesus Let Lord. Twix, right Twix, Reese's in the high licks. <laughs> what? Pull back the bolt on the 50 cal, fire it. Jesus Christ. Well, um, next uh, next month, uh, well, whenever this gets released, it's probably next month. In January... Uh, there's some games coming out, of course. Oh, Tekken 8, actually. Tekken 8? Yeah, so to answer the question you asked maybe like five minutes ago when we died laughing about candy. Yeah, uh, yeah I'm excited about Tekken 8. I was under the false pretenses that Yujiro and Baki would be in there because apparently it's just a fan-made trailer. But, I mean, it was really well made. I'm not going to lie. I'm going to put that up in the video. Yeah. But either way, I mean, it fits the theme of father hates son, son hates father in a way, though. It does. But... Yeah, I like fighting games. Man, uh, I don't... <laughs> I don't know if I have anything I'm looking forward to next year. Yeah. Uh, uh, Final Fantasy Rebirth. There's apparently Assassin's Creed on VR right now. That's the thing. Time to give birth. Got it. Uh, Persona 3. That's about it. Uh, did you? I seen on the list. Oh, were, South Park. A uh, South Park game. I seen on the list they are doing a remaster of Last of Us 2, and I was like, why? I'm sad thing is I want to buy it. 
Oh my god. Well, they, they're probably just gonna add another sex scene in there. No, uh, yeah. there's, uh, there's, like, they're adding two more game modes to it. I was about to say, two more sex scenes? Yeah, hopefully. Sold, boo. Rip. <laughs> Day one. <Yeah. laughs> hey? Speaking of which, um, uh, well, Prince of Persia's coming back. Ooh. Mm. That's been forever. Um, Last of Us, there we go. Dude, I think we're going to have to find the crown in Prince of Persia, the Lost Crown. Calm down, Indiana Jones. Master detective, bro. Mm. All right, all right. <laughs> Goddamn, Sherlock. Gravin, Slow never down. heard of that no, before. Really want to. <laughs> Ooh. Uh, yeah, a uh, new uh, Like a Dragon game coming out. No, that's a shark. I feel like you But you fight, fight the shark. shark. Yeah, but that's not like a dragon, that's a shark. Like a dragon shark. You might be onto something. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Photoshop <laughs> picture. <laughs> First you had my attention. Now you have my attention. Oh my. <laughs> is, it, eight? is it a dragon shark because it's dragging you down to the ocean? <clears throat> hey, Power World. Run your shit, sucker. <laughs> Damn. Oh, this! So I like that jacket. Nah, I me. Mean. That's the first EV to make me put my hands in the air. Dude, riding a dolphin, man. Oh God. I um, I don't really like the the dragon. That what is that? That's it's, that's a, like it's a Yakuza. Uh, y- Yakuza. That looks dumb. Yeah, yeah, sure. I don't like the Yakuza games. <clears throat> the neither. first, the first two, I think it was, were I. Right. But then after the third one, they introduced this guy in, like, some sort of weird RPG fighting style in a world that used to be, like, gangster shit. And you could kick a dude in a furnace. <laughs> Damn. And instead, he's like, oh, I do my fighting. But I do it like an old school RPG. And then he squares up and he's like, we're going to take turns up in this bitch. I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> Wah. Yeah, that's, uh, that's pretty much the lineup for uh for January. Um, Tekken 8 is going to be big. <laughs> I feel. Um... God, it. it makes no sense that they're remastering part two that came out on my birthday three years ago. Worst birthday ever. It was, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I was so excited for it. <laughs> Who knows, maybe they fixed the story. <laughs> and and, and uh, Joel doesn't die. It's too deep. It's too deep in. Bro, well, if they did that, they'd have to rewrite the whole story. It was stupid to have him just play play as him for just a little while only to kill him off. I, here's the thing, though. It's because, like, the fact that everyone became so attached to him in the first one, that I feel like it's very obvious that you're going to piss off so many people after you There is... I don't know if the article mentioned it, but there was a rumor going around that you can play as Joel again in the remake. In the remaster, sorry. Let me... Let me... Let me... Let me tell them to fuck off. <laughs> let, let the man rest. <laughs> let the man rest. Uh, top 10 games uh, by Metacritic. Who the fuck? Um, what the fuck? Jack Jenny? Never Jack heard Jenny. of it. Yeah, he never heard of it. Never heard of it. Turbo Overkill. Never I saw the it. box art for it. Never played it. And boxes are boxes, so fuck them. Apparently looks like a Doom or a Quake game. Uh, Against the Storm. Mm. Uh, I just want to know what this who this dude is. That's all I need to know. It looks like an otter with a beard. Huh. Street Fighter Six. I mean, it's high, but it's not the best fighting game this year. I still think Mortal Kombat did a better job. Hmm. You got a 92. Hey, look at that. What does that mean? 92 what? Uh, 92 of 100. That's what. 100 what? Motherfucker. Use your... You gotta, come on, dude. This is why fucking elementary school teachers get pissed off, because we don't ever be using the fucking little bit things, you know, you gotta put inches, you know, pounds, whatever the fuck. What are we measuring, man? You good? <laughs> I haven't had my Twix today. <laughs> <laughs> or a Reese's. Uh, Mario Wonder got 92 as well. RE4, oh, 93. I mean, got fifth place. I, I don't, I mean, come on though. I, couldn't you at least have yeah. tried to give it to a new game though? Uh, I mean, to be completely Man, honest. Who's playing content now? is not a new game. It is a new game. The added content is not a new game. It is it, a new game. It's, it's a new game. It is literally a new game. Xed it out. They presented the entire story differently this time. Took out the fucking sexy shirts. With a whole bunch of bear traps. I mean, yeah, they, yeah, they took out all the because they're trying and they to change a bunch of the extra bear traps. Game. But there's more chainsaw guys. There's more other enemies to kill. What's the less ogre. attractive, actually? Who cares? 
I mean, all the people who played for Ashley. Oh, yeah. God. I don't want to hear from you who simps over Chun Li, you fucker freak. <laughs> She's got the thighs. Oh, you're a freak. <laughs> <laughs> Asgard Wrath, never heard of it. Asgard's Rash. Oh, that is a VR game. The first one is actually pretty good. I have it. That is the second one. You got an ass rash? I'm going to kill you. Metro Prime released this year? After the pod, after the pod. Well, after I drop you off at home, too. Oh, my God. (laughs) Freaky shit's happening over here. (laughs) Uh, Mm. Again, I would still like to see in the top ten to be new games, if anything. Yeah, and I think that's like to our discussion we had before. Like, yeah, but how old is Prime compared to? That's what old. I'm saying. It's like it's almost it's twenty say, it's years. It's almost pretty years old. Now, I was about to say they've done less remakes of Metroid than they have of. So, I mean, years. that one I guess merits. That one I I would understand merit. But remaking. here's the thing: is if you're gonna top ten and it's gonna be an older game that was remastered or redone, I would prefer to see it in the top ten of remastered games instead. Uh, of we're gonna go. We're gonna go thirties again. That makes sense. Uh, Zelda. 96. I disagree with that one being number two, but that's okay. It's just a reskin. I haven't played it yet, but I mean... No, there's other stuff too. I was about to say, that, that's like saying the fucking, the same thing I'm saying about RE4, Ooh, though, because Baldur's they added Gate. so much to the fucking t- the Tears of the Kingdom as well. <clears throat> Baldur's Gate 9, 96. Why are you nutty? Yeah, mm-hmm. Are you good? Play the fucking game. <laughs> <laughs> I had a queen! <laughs> Fuck! You won't get out of my sack and at least wait till Jesus leaves. <sighs> yeah, it looks like you stay in the night. No. <laughs> well, I ain't waiting in the car for you to get your bone done. <laughs> so, I want to go back up through here. I do like Baldur's Gate at number one, though. I ain't gonna lie. That it makes so, sense. I want to go through all the games that either is a sequel or a remake. Okay. Uh, some of these I, will, I won't know. Um, so, Street Fighter is a sequel. I feel like previous versions of Street Fighter uh, I mean, had more intensity, though. I mean, to rephrase, new IP. So, it man, it man, it man, it man. Huh. So, Street Fighter, <laughs> Mario. <clears throat> State. Um, <clears throat> I wasn't getting attention. I was coughing. <clears throat> okay. <laughs> uh, Resident stop, Evil. Shut up. Stacy was playing Mario Wonder, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah, she's been having fun. She says it's pretty fun. All right, unshut up. Uh, Asgard, <laughs> Metroid, Zelda, Baldur's Gate. So seven out of ten are existing uh, mm-hmm. IPs. Yes. I bring this up because we had a previous conversation before uh, about how games are either getting remastered or remade too often. And even like sequels. Um, we're just not getting any, like, new event of games anymore. Uh, not as Baldur's Gate 3 is actually drastically different from the first two. Yep. And it actually plays closer to more actual D&D, which, uh, that's why I say I give it, yes. I'm okay with I will it. confirm with that because, because I played the original Baldur's Gate 2. Yep, and we also play D&D regularly at this point, and we've played it regularly in the so past. So Baldur's Gate 3 definitely it feels has, like a D&D campaign. It has, it has its closest re- like out of all pc D games that i've played basically it, it has the closest rendition to D, at least 5e um if, if that means anything to the nerds that understand the words coming out of my mouth oh i'm sure they do bud i just wish there was more event of games i i, I mean, feel I, like there's a lot of stagnation in but the, you have to in the remember back in the day i feel like companies had more time no, mm. it's more complicated to develop I mean, games now than it was. I mean, look at Bioshock. 2K Games hasn't made a lot of games lately. But they can write it out in fucking but they But they also have hinted at another Bioshock sometime. Well, th- that's still the same thing. There's no new... Uh, new I- IPs being generated. So don't act like that wouldn't be a new IP. It They'd wouldn't probably be. come up with a whole new location. It wouldn't be a new IP. It'd be, it'd be a Shock. continuation into the series. Yeah. So well, you're basically saying like a new game. Like oh, something well, fresh, yeah. something new. Oh, I, and I'm tired of like, I played, uh, oh fuck, it's a new game that just came out. So it's, it's a team-based shooter. The Legacy? Oh, Legs. Mm-hmm. Consulting Steam. The Lego C. Oh, show them your Steam wallet. Wow. 
or the credit card payment that you have registered to your student account from oh. that. Yeah, that's fine. Or them titties. <laughs> what? Deep as fuck. Don't judge me. I, I already judging. have. No! You're walking home. <laughs> no! I'll never get to work now. Thank well, God. I mean, just start walking towards work and you'll probably make it there on time. Uh, okay. The final. The finals. That is nothing close to what that you were is, saying. Yeah, that's not even close. It's a... Uh, what is this? Black Swan shit. It's, it's a team-based shooter. You should clip it to where he says it again, and then... And then the name of <laughs> Oh, like that one time where I asked you if we had our backs watching the tower, and, and, and we, we were... The finals. I was like, you see that guy? And you're like, yeah, I see him when you were looking at a tower, but when we were going towards a building... But in COD, in COD, in COD. He always references <laughs> that. Yes, because he, he says I listen, but then when we, when I check his point of view, this motherfucker's face in a completely different direction as we're running into a building to get me <clears> This is why we don't play COD anymore. No, this is why you don't play COD no more. <laughs> yeah, uh, so I'm tired of like the same type of game being being uh, released. Mm. I, I tried finals. I played it for 10 minutes. Here's um <laughs> just like absolutely hated it. Here's my here's my thing to what you're saying is you've ever you've ever heard the uh the phrase there's no more original ideas. Yeah. So in taking that sense, uh I think it's more about how more impressive slash dynamic slash well done what you've done is in the genre that you're doing. What are like because when you go to think about what sticks out in the FPS world? What are the first three games you think of? COD, Medal of Honor. Rainbow Six. Yeah. And those ones have all widely loved by many people because they do some things way better than other FPS games will be doing. Which, sadly, Medal of Honor is no longer a thing. That's a shame, too, because they had some of the best stories. What was it? Uh, Medal of Honor for uh, PS3. That when it came out was like my favorite shooter like during that time there is a medal of honor vr game that i have purchased i've been trying to make space i need another uh internal memory of high quality i can't remember what it's called right now what is it called yeah another ssd drive you had three letters (laughs) you had to remember your name is four I know. <laughs> You're pushing. Thank God your name is actually three letters. Your, user, your username and your real name are four letters. <laughs> Shh. It's okay. Jesus Christ. Anyway, I need another SSD drive in order to play it, but it is pretty good. Well, the D stands for drive. Because you can pick up all the antique weapons and stuff from the time period and and shoot but them at the shooting range in the my, my whole point is uh, if you're going to release a new game, it's probably not going to be a new idea. But it is in your best interest to basically make it uniquely better than something. Like, what are the things that you like? Because, I mean, if it comes down to it, you, you're you just going to want to be able to attract more people than the other games, right? So in order to do that, you have to have some either function or some sort of feature in the game that's going to stand out more. I feel like VR technology is going to be the frontier it's got a long way to go for I even bother trying to buy one. I don't know. I like I like mine a lot. Playing it's not, it's not a matter of dislikes. It's a matter of the simplicity of the games. Playing I feel like there's not enough, like, actually, there's not a lot of selection when it comes to great games on the VR that no, hasn't not yet. been done on an actual console. Already. That's because there's a lot of companies that aren't into it yet. But there is will. one game that comes to mind that's on VR and on consoles traditionally, and PC. Um, that's much better in VR. The super hot. Huh. I, yeah, yeah, that was yeah. that one. Yeah. That one I'll give it credit for. But at the same time, like, you can only do so much super hot before you're like, all right, I'm done. Because yeah. after a while, you want a story driven game or you want an action packed game that's not just fucking you slow mean, movement. Boneworks movement. is one that's pretty good. I haven't. Boneworks Lab is is like some some for some sort of G mod shit. And I'm not knocking it for being that. I'm just saying like if you want me to start investing into VR gaming, I'm gonna need something more substantial. There's also Fallout and Skyrim. I don't want anything that's already been done on a console because at that point, why don't I just play it on my computer? That's gonna give me much better fucking everything, basically. Uh, I don't know about that, G. <laughs> Playing Skyrim VR is a lot more fun. It it it. Eh, I could do without swinging my arms around like a retard. <laughs> Suit yourself. 
So, uh, just a quick update um, for PlayStation Plus people. Um, on January 2nd, um, we got new games for free. Uh, the Plague Tale Requiem. Pretty good game. Evil West, heard great things about it. Um, Actually, yes. Evil West is so fun. I play it on my PC every now and then. And, and fucking, you can do some nasty combos. There's some interesting abilities. You can have different classes. I think there's like three or four. I think you were telling me about that. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It's a co-op multiplayer, so you can play with one other buddy. Nice. And nobody, nobody saves the world. No idea what that is. That's just regular life. Yeah. <laughs> Except for Greta. She got me trying. This, <laughs> the meme in the background is, I need a hero. <laughs> I need a hero. It's like that one Doritos commercial. Yeah. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Uh, then we got one more thing today. Uh, Saints Row is now a freebie on the Epic Store. Um, so it, which is a really like funny conclusion to everything. Because hold the, on, let developer, me fix your headline. Uh, the developer actually shut down after releasing this game. Um, just it just adds like a little cherry to the story. Can I add another cherry? Yeah, give me the cherries. So Julio downloaded it on his PlayStation Four. This is before Christmas because he got a PS Five for Christmas, right? But on the PS Four, he downloaded it. Um, he made space. He downloaded. It, he was giving it a shot. And it was it was equivalent the equivalent of the meme of I mean it's alright and he was like I'm playing it for a while and then he's like oh I'm gonna download Black Ops Four again with all my DLC maps so we can play on Kino Dare Toten and then I was like oh that's a sick idea and then when he went to download it he ran out of memory space so the first thing he chose was Saints Row to uninstall so that way we could play <laughs> and so the first thing that he chose was the one that he gave a try he said ah, I'm gonna play it later it's not terrible and then he's like eh, I mean I'd rather have zombies. An old map of zombies that released so, way so back fi- when. To fix your article heading there, game was so terrible that Epic is allowing people <laughs> to have it for free. That's not exactly true. They give up good games all the time. Not, not all, all the time. time. When I first started getting into PC gaming, one of the first few games that they were giving out, though, was the Arkham Collection for Batman. That one. That's a nice game. And they gave out GTA. Occasionally, they give out good ones, yeah. Um, Dauntless was fun, but that's just free in general. Oh yeah, that I one is to, already. Fun. I have to check out what it's on right now. I haven't played. Oh my forever. goodness, they probably have a whole different city again. Uh yeah. What else was it? Um, what else have they given? I I can't remember off the top of my head what else they've given, but they've given out some games that I've actually had some moderate fun with. Uh, Epic Games was one of the first few game launches besides Steam that I downloaded before I went onto Xbox to get the um, Game Pass. Hmm. Uh, I actually, I've, I've been thinking about doing um, a modded run of Fallout 4 again. Nice. Well, but anyway, uh, I actually, for being on the list of Game of the Year, I do not I do not wholesomely agree with Spider-Man be- 2 being on there. Because of how, well, not not because it's a bad game. It's actually a really good game from when I was watching Julio play it. But the reason why is because it came out with like a couple months before the fucking awards was not like, you know. And I'm like, come on. Let everybody feel it a little more than that, because there was uh, there was a good number of games that came out that year that could have been. I was gonna say way. games that release in like October or December really shouldn't be part of the game awards. Um, I do, I do want to say that except for maybe for the next year after that. Watching Julio play Spider Man Two though, shit was fucking awesome looking. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, when you're fighting against Venom in the last fight, and that dude like stops on the top I mean, of a church or some shit and sprouts like evil. PlayStation games. likes the game so much they decided to release it with PS5s. So, <clears throat> but they've been liking the game for so long. I mean, that's just yeah, they, they like the too. first one so much they bought the studio. Yeah. <laughs> Insomniac. Yeah. 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 And and Insomniac does do good work. I, I they're the guys that came. Over I Crash want. Bandicoot. Here's the thing: is that you're not going to see Spider Man outside I'm of New York, either. so that's why it's always going to be New York. But they they do go out of their way to add different suits that you didn't see in previous ones and give you new tools and equipment to that you haven't messed with on the previous ones as well. You know what? There's two games that pop in my mind that I'm dying for. I want a new Twisted Metal so bad. Yes. And I want a new Jack and Daxter so bad. Yeah. I, I mean, I'll take it, but Twisted Metal, I'm with you 100% of the way. That could be so good nowadays. I'm looking for Twisted Metal Black. I want to play it again. Um, but do you want to go over uh, what, we're do- what we're planning on doing in the beginning of the year? Because uh, that part was dead. Oh, yeah, we plan on doing stuff. <laughs> you got it good, pal. 
Mm-hmm. I'm very good at summarizing. <laughs> <laughs> do, we, do we want to go through over that, over that or not? I thought we just did. <sighs> um, we doing some... <laughs> Anyways, um, so... Things that we're going to be doing in the new upcoming year. What are we doing? We are doing more types of videos other than podcasts. We wanted to kind of branch out to the many different types of nerds that have similar tastes to each one of our different palettes. We're doing game reviews, retrospective game reviews. videos. You want to? I know uh, you are working. You're working on a review right now from my free product we received. You want to? You do you want to give like a do brief the disclaimer taste? first? I, I said we received the free product. Yep, we received the product free from keymailer.com. And the game idea Give me like give me like two sentences about how you feel. In short, the idea is good. The follow up, the follow through on it, not so good. Great. Um uh, look forward to that video. Uh, that should be coming out soonest when this comes out. I think. Maybe. We still have time. Uh, but we're also be working on uh, video game pickups, um, unboxings, those, unboxings, um, anything we can really. Do. I want to do more YouTube shorts. Yeah, I shorts are I really thinking, fun. I was thinking one of my ideas is uh, songs that could totally be in cyberpunk. <laughs> Just have killing montages with the songs in the background for like fifteen seconds, because you know. That's a good idea. Because that's all we can do with it, really. Well, I think it's actually like seven seconds before you get fucking hit with it, but I don't give a fuck. I want to jam out. Mm-hmm. I'm not doing this for money. I'm doing this for fun. <laughs> that's YouTube shorts. Like, if it was even paid, we'll get like two cents. Nice. Mm, not even, because we only got like two viewers, but... Yeah, I mean, yeah, that's true. That's whatever. <laughs> but we yeah. actually... No, that's a, that's one thing I should probably bring up. We hit about a thousand views this month. Oh, damn Oh, but that's like liquid, like spread across from like all the vids that we've done or what? All, all, all the vids. So like what? Four podcasts mm-hmm. and like six shorts. Why don't you go to our older videos, you assholes? Oh, I, I, <laughs> to, to be honest with you, I, I privated all of them. What? You guys are no longer assholes. Mars is. I, uh, I left up um, our um, news videos. Uh-huh. The sad guys video because the <laughs> intro was hilarious. Uh, <laughs> is it, wait, is it the one with the truck or the one with the phone call one? The one with the uh, police support. I was gonna say because I remember one of them. I had an F one fifty running over my sad guy. <laughs> that is the same video. It might be. I it is fucking. The same it's so long ago. I oh, and I found an old Monster Hunter video that you never fucking uploaded, motherfucker. Even after I sent it to you, I already chopped. I already confronted testing. him. Anyway, about it. <laughs> he didn't remember it. No, but in the last, I'm uh, gonna send it to him again. I have to cut it up again That's because true. it's no longer relative. Oh, you're it. working on a lot of Monster Hunter stuff, aren't you? Uh, yes, yeah. man. I, um, I'm i doing a retrospective video on Monster Hunter. Um, I want to do probably layered armor videos because I feel like everyone else is pretty dog shit at it. Maybe armor builds based on the armor skills rather than on talismans because assholes will be out there with like divine talismans level 1,000 million. Yeah, like, you're like, yeah, all you need to do is get extremely lucky and hit this percentile chance. Uh, talking about nah, 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 now nah, I want to nah, do that nah. cyberpunk uh, songs that could be in cyberpunk um, which Link can help me with because we listen to a lot of punk music oh, yeah. um, what else do we want to do we wanted to do retrospective videos of old school video games best part uh, is we could use old school punk too oh and I want us to collaborate together on a Legend of Zelda kind of series oh yeah I think uh, Panda was saying something about that yeah I think I think it'd be something good that me and you because we're both basically huge fans of the oh yeah series. yes very much. Uh, oh, and and finally, from me, I don't know if I have anything other than the idea of oh, yeah. opening the more Japanese Dragon Ball cards. Yet? Do what? Did the Japanese copy come in yet? Of what? Of Zelda. No, that's on the second. Yeah, okay. but yeah, I want to open more uh, Dragon Ball cards on the booster booster boxes. Maybe I'll get so lucky and get another God the... Um, what did, did you have? What were you wanting to do? He is Eric is doing hidden. Hey, run. How about you let him talk for himself? I'm going to be uh, doing, doing hit and run. <laughs> I will throat chop you. <laughs> but yeah, so we, we just want to do a bunch of other videos. To I'm going to be working on a long video for Parasite Eve. Oh, yeah. Our got um, a parasite. Yeah. And Eric is a parrot. <laughs> it's luckily it's only a, uh, about. I am a, not. It's a parrot. Oh, Paris. luckily okay. it's only about a ten-hour game, so it's pretty short. But like the history behind the first one, how it became a series, 
pretty interesting. There's a hole in my shoe. There is a hole in your shoe. Well, it's working. I got new shoes. Not for long. Yeah. No. Anyways, um, but yeah, we we just kind of wanted to branch out into various other types of videos that may catch more viewers, uh, hypnotize them, give us their credit card information. And hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. So anyway, thank you for watching. Idea. Have a good day. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, thank you for uh, checking us out. Um, and as I always, have a mangina. Why do you always have to interrupt people? Ah, ah, ah. Yeah, man. Subscribe to the channel because I know sixty percent of you fuckers are not subscribed. One hundred percent of the time. <laughs> Jesus, I'm not even subscribed. <laughs> Keep your fingers crossed because the funny videos are coming. Oh yeah, there's a T Rex that came on his face too. Oh my god. <laughs> That's what we're ending.